Hello everyone, Father Martin here. I'd like to begin with a little story about Pope Emeritus Benedict when he was a young seminarian, and he was sitting through a very dry lecture about how God is the summum bonum, the highest good. And upon leaving the lecture hall, he told a fellow classmate that a summum bonum doesn't need a mother. He wasn't denying that God is the highest good, but he knew that our faith was much more than a cold, abstract proposition. Our faith is personal, it's historical, and it is incarnational. Our God is the God of faces. He is the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob. And it is through faces that he continues to reveal himself through history. It is through these faces that we actually come to a deeper understanding of the mystery. And in a special way, we come to know God more intimately through the face of his mother. As we celebrate the solemnity of Mary, the mother of God, let us remember that we can't bypass Mary to get to God out there. We need her on our earthly pilgrimage. Why? Because God desires it. He desires that we go to his mother for our needs, for her prayers, for her intercession, for her protection, and for her lo love. You know, God did not need a mother, but he desired one. So my dear friends, let God's desire for a mother spill over into our hearts. Let us run to Mary. Let us go to her knowing that she leads us to a deeper relationship with her son. Jesus Christ.